It's not really common in a software development event uh, to meet people like she, hello, and she is Trisha Gee. Trisha Gee, she's a software developer, really known. And who's this? Eva. My hello, Eva. My little girl. Uh, Eva is, the, is your daughter, right? And Trisha is here because she's the, she the speaker of the next talk uh, having here at, at Landa World. So Trisha, what are your expectations for your talk? I mean, wh what would you like the attendees to learn with it? I, I'm talking a little bit about some of the functional style programming which has come into Java 8 particularly. So I'm kind of wanting to talk about how Java is becoming a slightly more functional type of uh, language and what those, what those idioms look like in, in Java. Uh, so I kind of want people, I want Java developers to sort of see some of the new styles of programming and I want non-Java programmers to see that um, Java language is evolving um, along more modern lines and things aren't the same as they might have learned at university, things mm -hmm. like that. So according to Java 8 new changes, do you think Java is definitely evolving to functional programming, is getting closer to it? I think it's borrowing some functional ideas, definitely. But it's not going to become a functional language, I don't think. But there are some really nice ideas from functional programming which will benefit an object-oriented language like Java. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of moving in that direction, but it, I don't think it's ever going to be like full functional. I'm really impressed by your curriculum because I've read you're involved, besides being a Java champion, uh, you're really involved with London Java community, Seville MongoDB community, Java user group in Seville as well. You're a mother, you're a developer, you work. How do you get to manage all of that? Um, I don't really. <laughs> you know, things have to come and go. So I haven't been as involved in MongoDB lately. And things just basically have to ebb and flow as the work ebbs and flows. So when I'm very busy with work or, or with the baby, then I do less community stuff. But when I've got more time, then I can do some more community stuff. It's really about picking, picking your battles, picking what's important right here and now. Okay, so see you at your talk. Thank you.